Hello, so just finished some work in the last couple of weeks for Sweat Elite as they bridge the gap from running to triathlon. So yeah, I'm helping them with that. Obviously knowing a lot of the triathletes and having worked with them over the last couple of years, it makes an easy transition. Sweat Elite have been amazing to work for. So it was a pretty open-ended brief. They just wanted a video of each athlete. Between me and the athlete, we got to decide what we did and how we made that. Here's the intro and I'll be back in a second. bit more about what we got up to so the athletes we were using or I was using was Ruth because obviously we were already filming a lot of video content together Beth because again I know I've worked with Beth quite a long time so it's quite an easy formula and Lucy Byron because um, yeah I get on with Lucy really well and I thought she was going to do some exciting things this season which she's obviously already started to do so that was really cool to see so if you haven't already watched the videos, head over to the Sweat Elite channel, but here's a bit more about how we made them and what we got up to. Started with Beth, we decided we'd film a day in the life, so uh, we did that on a Tuesday, because that's usually Beth's um, sort of like hard training day, she'll have a VO2 swim in the morning, an easier ride of an hour to two hours, and then track in the evening. And obviously coming from a track background, that's one of her key sessions of the week. She absolutely loves doing track. So yeah, that was really good to see. She really focuses on doing longer reps on track now, really high quality, and um, cause she only does sort of one running session in the week and the rest is bike and swim. So we decided that was the best way to showcase what she gets up to and the hard work she puts in. So yeah, we did that. Started with a swim, filmed her in the pool and then moved. Yeah, asked her a bit about what she's getting up to. Did a bike ride with Nora Muir, which was really cool. And then, then got ourselves down to the track. We weren't using the track in La Nucia because there was a footy match on. So we were using a different track, but nonetheless, it was still did the job. Yeah, here's some footage of that. With Lucy Byron, we decided to focus on a single high quality session. So she's working with Jacob Tipper, her new coach. He also coaches Dan Bigan, the cyclist. So yeah, super knowledgeable guy, uh, knows a lot about the industry. So he was out in Pollock with us. So yeah, we've got a bit of his thoughts, what Lucy was focusing on for the session, what outcomes she wanted, how she was feeling, and just kind of did 
the more traditional sweat elite type video. So yeah, we picked Thursday Threshold Classic for the triathletes, the Leeds based triathletes. They do a variety of sessions from an hour of power to, you know, three by 15 minutes or whatever, you know, three by a, a certain climb. So yeah, she was riding with Ruth. Some intervals to do. So yeah, I filmed that and that was really good fun. So you can see that coming up now. I'm Lucy Byer, I'm a professional long course athlete. Um, we're currently in Calpe in um, Spain doing a three week training camp and I've got a bike session this afternoon. I'm Jacob Tipper and I'm Lucy's coach. So we're just doing some work on like on a time trial bike in a time trial position. And finally with Ruth, again we decided it's best to do sort of a day in the life. We we're already filming a week in the life separate so we decided to sort of move away from the more vloggy quality and move to a nice like sort of premium video for Sweat Elite. We picked Saturday because she had a hard run in the morning which was a key session for the day and then a four to five hour ride in the afternoon with a cafe stop. So. Uh, she also swam in between a little extra session big big day of training obviously very different to how a runner might structure their program so we thought it'd be cool to show that i just got got involved i actually ran the session with her did my own little swim and then we obviously rode together so behind the scenes that kind of rather than hiring a car and it all other rather than driving the car car hire is quite cheap out there it all gets a bit logistically complicated when you're trying to meet them you can't film side by side unless you take a driver no one wants to sit in a car for four or five hours of a ride. So for this kind of video, we figured it would be best for me to just ride as well. So yeah, I got stuck in and had a lot of fun. So yeah, here's the clips. Hello, it's Saturday morning and we're ready for a tempo run. Session done, um, swim now, and then yeah, ride this afternoon. <laughs> 